night, we're going to talk about Juneteenth becoming a federal holiday. But it's more symbolism, but no tangibles when it comes to reparations. This government loves to give us symbolism, but they refuse to pay us our reparations. It is so easy to give us MLK Day, Juneteenth, put Harriet Tugman on a $20 bill. But what's difficult for them to do is pay us, cut the check for our ancestors in the lives that has toiled on this nation's grounds. We deserve reparations. We do not deserve any more symbolism. There is no holiday for Jewish people. Yes, they celebrate Hanukkah, Passover, but those are not holidays. They are religious days. But one thing the Jewish people do receive is something called reparations. It's something that the Asians receive when they were put in internment camps during World War II. It was called reparations because the act that was put on them was so heinous that Germany in America, when it came to the Japanese, decided that these people whose rights in their lives were thrown away and destroyed deserved reparations. But it seems like we have the smiles and the grins when we receive nothing more than a signed bill, as you see right here. Yes, federal workers get a day off. Yes, it's a holiday. But do you receive any cash payments? Do you receive anything from your ancestors? This is something, yes, to be proud of, to have a holiday. But it's really nothing to celebrate. In a baseball game, you haven't even gotten to first base. Right now, after 400 years in this country, we should be at third base. On our way to going home and getting our reparations. This country owes us between 10 and 16 trillion dollars. And they haven't even put a down payment on giving us that money. But they put a hell of a down payment on symbolism. I told you an American Rescue Act. They paid reparations to the Native Americans and Asian Pacific Islanders. They gave them $32.6 billion in federal funds but gave us nothing. They gave the Asians in that hate crime bill over $50 million plus what they'll receive during the annual budget. You have to understand, respect is given when dollars are transferred. And we seem not to understand that. We seem to buck dance and smile when we receive this type of symbolism, something signed on a desk. But the only thing our true enemies respect is when you hand over cash, when you hand over land, when you hand over precious materials. See, this is how they deal with us when it comes to business. They deal with us with symbolism writing proclamations, going to cities after they have been burnt down a hundred years. But when it comes down to it, where's the check? During this ceremony, 
that you see with Nancy Pelosi and one you will probably see with Joe Biden. Will you see any of them, any of them talk about reparations? Will you see any of them talk about the dollar signs of handing money over? I don't want to hear anything about a commission. See, a commission is something where they sit around and study. Is it feasible enough for us to have reparations? But I would like to say this. We have all the proof that you need. There would be no Juneteenth Day if you didn't believe something heinous happened to us while in this country. All we need is to sit down at a table and discuss negotiations on how much it should be paid. That's what the commission should be about. No more, no less. And if that is not what the commission is about, is it just about wasting time? Is it about getting us to the midterm elections? Then when it comes time to get us to the next election in 2024, will they promise you something, but you'll never receive it? We have to have some serious politicians in this country. Serious politicians who right now can put a bill in front of Congress. The same time you had Juneteenth Day, you should have had that reparations bill connected right to that bill. You should have made every Democrat in Congress vote on that bill and pass that bill, send it to the Senate, Go through reconciliation, pass it 51 to 50, and give it to Joe Biden, and we would have had reparations of somehow in cash payments. But this is our payback, another federal holiday, and some niggas will be happy with that. That tells you where we're at in America. It's all about getting that check. It's all about getting paid for what our ancestors have done. They built this country. They built the foundation of this country. And they deserve to be recognized with dollars. Not a day off. Not a celebration. But with dollars and cents. I want to thank you for listening to Black Sight. I hope you subscribe to this channel. Smash that like button, but also share this video.